Praise the Lord, my brothers and sisters. This is Sister Judy coming to you from my beautiful stream. It's been a while since I come here. Let's just say a quick word of prayer. Father, I thank you for this beautiful day. I thank you for grace. I thank you for mercy. I thank you for your extension of love and grace that you're giving unto your people. I thank you, Father, for everything that you're about to say. Holy Spirit, come and stay beside me right now as I say what the Lord has been laying on my heart and my spirit to speak to his people. Now, I was reading John this morning, but John 10, but verse 29, 28, 29, and 30 really stood out to me where the Lord is talking about they that are his. I'm just going to rephrase it. They that are his, no man shall pluck them out of his hands. And what his father has given unto him, no one will be able to take it from him because no one can take anything what the father has done because he and the father is one. Now, I say this because the Lord has been showing me a whole lot of things that has been going on, especially on YouTube. The Lord want me to focus on there are certain people on YouTube that are making videos. And what happened, most of those people that came out, that was supposed to go through into the third dimension, they did not go over. So what is happening now, the enemy has captured a lot of them. I don't even know if some of them realize that they are captured. So the enemy is using them now. And these people are making a lot of video. Even some days they are firing out three, four, five videos. And they are not coming from the spirit of the Almighty God. What I want you to know, they are in the second dimension. They did not flow through into the third dimension. So where they are sitting, they are sitting at a part that I would call chatters. Up there is very noisy. It is so noisy. And everybody is there hearing what is coming from the familiar spirit. They are hearing, 99, they are hearing almost 98.9. But you see the rest that they are not hearing. It's very dangerous to God people. Because the enemy is giving, giving them what he wants you to know. And taking you off the right track of Jesus Christ. Now I say this because I think the Lord is going to expose a lot of things that is going on. Because he's not going to allow these false workers that are working for the enemy to lead his people astray. The enemy doesn't even want you to think for yourself. So he's sending out these videos so fast, you don't even have time to do what you want to do. But the Lord is going to put a grip to these people and he is going to, he is going to let people know that these people are not speaking from the throne of God. They are now caught up in the second dimension. They are outside the gate. They did not go through the gate. So what they're hearing, they're hearing more like what a psychic can tell you stuff. Remember when Saul went to the wish, the wish and he got his information and he got exactly what would happen. The next day you and your son will be where I am. So they're hearing, but there are some crucial part that they are not hearing, brothers and sisters. And we reach a stage now where the fight is in the governmental level. We talk about the 12 level is governmental level. And if we understand the governmental level, that is only for people who slip over the third dimension and is now in the fourth level, in the fourth dimension. So in the fourth dimension, you have 10, 11, and 12 level. Now, we are going through a time where everybody needs to know where you're standing. Do not try to go up against these governmental level if you are not where you are supposed to be. 
everything take time in everything take a while and if you understand why when Paul was preaching and that girl that offers so much was following with the familiar spirit why Paul allowed that to happen for certain days the enemy knows right where you are standing and he knows he have a certain time to hit after you when it is not your time to go over you see Paul knew that girl was a bit above his level because he was about to go up to another level to defeat that spirit so he had patience and he wait and then he go up against that spirit and took it out this is what I want you people to know there is also a very tricky spirit I did a video couple I think 2019 where I was talking about you have this witch on YouTube she has a clown spirit and what she's doing if you understand what a clown is it doesn't use its body but it zip up in someone else's body and that's what you see a lot of you that witch is playing with you and that witch is also going into people vision and making trouble and a lot of you are going after the wrong people because who you think those people are that's not them it's the witch that is hiding you see these are things we have to understand recently I was fighting this spirit and what that spirit asked me to do as I was passing that person that the spirit was using I had on this nice hat on my head and that spirit wanted me to exchange my hat and give her take her hat and give her my hat but I realize because I know spiritual stuff I know it's because my spirit is above her she wants my hat to rule at my level but I did not do it these are things you have to know you're never supposed to take off your crown and give it to another person if you if they see you with something that they like well, you can buy one for them, but never exchange yours. Because what you're going to do, you're going to take on their demonic spirit. And you start to work the way they used to work. And you don't even realize that the spirit is playing you. Because I had to go up against that spirit just the other day. And I want people to know, we have to be careful now. We need to check our spirit and ask the Lord, am I standing where you want me? Am I captured? Some of you are captured in the marine kingdom. Some of you are captured here on earth. And some of you are captured in the forest kingdom. That one, if I, I'm going to explain it for you people to understand the way the forest kingdom works. It's a spirit that comes to steal. That's where the steal begins because it knows you do not understand because you're not at the level where you understand what is happening so the spirit friend you and then it steals what you have because you know trust that person so when you see that person in a vision you trust them and you hand over your position to them but God is about to do things where people need to understand you see God is sounding the alarm and the people that God is going to be using to sound the alarm, it's not people that people expect. And this is where a lot of you are going to miss out on those that were sent to help you. You will not hear the sound of the alarm because it's not who you expect God is going to use to help you or to take you through. This is why a lot of you did not go through the last time because of the person God was using to take you through into the third dimension you got locked out so you're now outside of the gate most of you the enemy capture you and you're working in a ministry that was not given to you by God and now the enemy can use you and you're misleading God people there is so much information that is coming out on YouTube that is coming from the pit of hell it's not from God and I want you people to know, we have these Baal prophets, they are making so much noise. But now God is about to move up the Elisha spirit, because you have been making noise now.
So the truth will come out to see who has the real God. God bless you, my brothers and sisters. I did not come to make a video, but each time I come for a walk, the Lord always puts something in my spirit. I try to put as much now as I want to say, because you see, I just came off a 40 day fast and there is a whole lot of information that I'm holding on to that I know I am going to, the Lord told me he's going to use me to straighten up a lot of things in YouTube because a lot of people just have the mystery and they're there playing with things in the 12 dimension and making so much error for people that are going to do what is right. But when the correction come, go in, pick what is yours and be quiet because God is about to move and God is going to take care of his people. So God bless you all. I seal this word with the ring of Yeshua HaMashiach. I seal it in the blood of the Lamb.